I was chasing fools go. I was chasing fools go. I was chasing fools go. Hey y'all, I'm back y'all with another video. So I'm um, just lighting up some sage. Yes, yes, yes. getting ready for y'all video i hope everyone is doing all right and if you are new to my channel guys welcome 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 all right don't forget to click the like button and the share button with your family and your friends and subscribe guys we would love to have you here all right so Let's talk, guys. Let's talk. Let's talk. Let's talk. Let's see what's going on. How you gonna say no to this? For my Virgos, what messages are there for my Virgos? This is going to be from November 17th through the 20th. Did I want to say the 25th? Yeah. November 17th through the 25th. All right. So this is going to be a general message. Keep in mind, guys, this message may or may not resonate with you, okay? You can check your moon and your rising signs if this message does not resonate, all right? So, this is your weekly, Virgos. Weekly energy, okay? I was chasing fools go. I was chasing fools go. Virgos, let's see. Virgo, Virgo, Virgo. What message do you have for my Virgos? Give me a message for Virgos, please. Okay, it looks like Virgos are making forward movement. All right, looks like things are progressing with my Virgos. Forward movement is a chariot card here. Okay, you could be dealing with a cancer, but this is definitely progress being made. Okay, we got the nine of pentacles here. Yeah, y'all doing the damn thing right here. Okay, y'all are being strong, confident, and it's, yeah, like you you guys are moving forward with some type of plan, plot twist, or whatever. Yeah, it's the fool. Okay, so y'all are definitely taking risks, okay? Taking risks and doing what needs to be done, okay? So y'all are going getting ahead, all right? So... Let's talk, my Virgos. Okay. Yeah, we got the three of pentacles. All right. The six of swords. All right, these came out together. We got the five of wands and the six of wands okay so it looks like y'all are going through some type of battle okay maybe you feel like you know you are winning the battle okay and I, i'm seeing as well like a competition of who's best i'm seeing that as well too okay we got the four of swords okay we got the devil Oh, this jumped out. And then we got the Four of Cups. Okay. Okay. What I'm getting right off the bat was very interesting to me is this Six of Wands and this Five of Wands that just jumped out. Okay. What I'm getting is that there is some type of competition for sure, for sure. Like I'm getting there's comp like competition. The Five of Wands is definitely letting me know that there is like a multitude of people, more than one or two people, that is battling for something. And someone here being victorious, okay? Someone who thinks they're better, someone who you're competing against, someone who's competing against you. I don't know what the case may be, but I'm definitely feeling like there's some competition. Now, with the Three of Pentacles here, this could be in regards to like work, okay? This could be in regards to work, or this could be someone's business. Maybe, you know, you're trying to say some steps ahead of someone in business. Three of Pentacles could also be three people, okay? 
the wheel of fortune wants to jump out i'm getting like a good job okay i'm getting like yeah for some of you it's a boss or someone is their own boss okay king of pentacles want to jump out king of pentacles here with the three of pentacles somebody here is trying to you know uh make sure they're manifesting their money and trying to align on the frequency of wealth i see that as well you're very very some of y'all are definitely honing into your spiritual tapping into your spiritual abilities okay we got the high priestess and the hermit here which is uh pisces and virgo's energy here but I'm definitely getting that there is like some spiritual something. You could be going through something spiritual, okay? Maybe you are isolating yourself, you know, so you can get a better uh, relationship with self. As well as you can tap into certain type of abilities when you, you know, you're uh, getting at a long time and, you know, that one-on-one -on -one time, okay? I'm just getting like some of y'all are isolating yourselves from everybody, Okay, I'm getting as well too. If somebody you feel like if somebody asks where you at, you're gonna tell them that you're busy. You got this, this, that going on. But I feel like you may feel like this person is an enemy. I'm just getting it. Like you feel like this person is an enemy. Why is the page of wands here? And strength card. Could be dealing with the Leo. But I'm here and having the confidence to say. Having the confidence to say something. Okay, something here about your money. It's kind of, I'm kind of getting like, oh, this person had the nerve to ask me about my money. Or where I'm at. You may feel like somebody's trying to peep where you at to see what you got going on. Okay, but we got the five of pentacles and the ten of pentacles here. So maybe you feel like somebody's trying to, you know, pocket watch, you know. Could be children could be involved with the six of cups and the eight of wands. But there could be talks about the past as well, too. Family could be involved. But I'm getting that you cut something out. You cut somebody off or you cut something off. Something got cut off. You want to give something a break. Give something some time before you, uh, you know, communicate with this person. We got the star card here. You could be dealing with an Aquarius. But I'm just getting like, I'm just getting like you guys are feeling like somebody is an enemy or a competitor. You're very tired of it. You're actually tired of this energy or this person coming towards you like that. Okay, some of y'all are taking a break, you know, resting a lot. You know, thinking. Yeah, we got the moon. Pisces, Cancer, Energy. Some of y'all are really, really like, you know, thinking at night. I'm getting like sleeping, resting. Okay, you're doing a lot of resting. Okay, I see that as well. Like during this week, you you could be like pretty tired. Some of you could be dealing with a definitely a Pisces. <clears throat> The King of Cups and the Justice here could be dealing with the Libra. Yeah, I'm getting like you feel tired. Um, I'm just getting like some of y'all are tired from work. Why is the devil here? The high priestess. Mm. 
the high priestess and the sun yeah oh i'm getting it oh oh somebody playing some mind games love playing mind games the lovers could be dealing with the gemini the magician the five of swords then we got the devil. It's like you know some, you know what somebody's doing. You see what they're doing. And you feel like, oh, yeah, they love to play mind games. They love to play. <clears throat> Could be a Capricorn. We got Pisces right here with the High Priestess, Page of Swords. <clears throat> then we got the Five of Swords and the Magician. That's very, you know, like somebody's trying to, um, this is shallow victory, Okay. Maybe you feel like somebody's trying to make you jealous. Um, but for some, you, you got your eye on this person. You got your eye on this person. Why is the page of swords here? You got the hierophant. Could be dealing with a Taurus. King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, the Ace of Wands, Fire, Energy, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Okay, it's like you see it, you're, you're, your intuition may be telling you somebody's taking something serious. Okay? When somebody's taking something serious and you're actually really surprised by it. Somebody's taking something very serious. Somebody started a business or got a promotion at work. Oh, Ten of Cups wanted to jump out. Okay, so maybe you're very happy about this. Why is the Ten of Pentacles here? Yeah, the Ten of Cups came back out. So the Ten of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles, this is very, you know, very good energy. This is financial stability and emotional stability, okay? So you're, I'm getting like you're proud, okay? Maybe you didn't think this could be you. Maybe you didn't think you could do it. Or maybe you didn't think this person could do it. But you see that there's steady progress. I'm getting their steady progress. Okay. Think somebody here is diligently working. And it's a continuous thing. Like I'm getting consistency. Consistency is key. Consistency is key. Okay. Because there's something that you possibly are working on. But you took a break. And I see you in the past, like you're you're watching, you're watching someone else, okay? And then you're seeing like, okay, well they're taking it serious. I feel like you're proud, but at the same time, I feel like you may feel the way that you're viewing this is is my thing. It's the way that it's being viewed, okay? It's viewed as a competitor or a competition. The five of wands and the six of wands. And I'm going to go back to that. Why is the five of wands here? Okay, temperance. You could be dealing with the Sagittarius. But I'm just getting... Yeah, like, it's like you're surprised. Got the tower here, which is Scorpio's energy. Surprised, like you've been waiting to take action or you're waiting for this person to take action. You haven't spoken to this person, but you've been watching the growth. Okay. Why is temperance here? Knight of Pentacles. Okay, the Knight of Pentacles is slow and steady. Okay, slow and steady, but it's progressing slow and steady. But I feel like for some of you, you aren't in, on the same page with somebody. I'm getting like you aren't on the same page with somebody. Okay, somebody may need to apologize with the Eight of Wands and Three of Swords. So this is someone that you're no longer close to, but maybe you're watching. You know, you're watching them, but you guys aren't close like you used to be. I'm hearing that as well.
we got the four of cups for future energy this is very you know bored or you know un unhappy unsatisfied not being fulfilled okay queen of swords okay maybe you feel cut off okay because i do see like i said there's these two jumped out again the death and the two of cups okay this is you know a partnership ending a relationship ending a bond or connection and somebody the same cards came out the eight of wands and the three of swords an apology maybe you're surprised that it's been this long somebody here is extremely defensive or you may feel i'm getting like maybe you feel bullied by this person see with the seven of wands and the eight of swords this is someone that's kind of like defensive or feeling the need to defend themselves because somebody feels like they're scared okay maybe you're scared to reach out to this person you really might not really know what to say um but you're watching them okay so you're disappointed we got the queen of swords you could be dealing with the libra gemini aquarius the fool okay yeah see maybe you didn't think this was you know this person would take things this far but i'm getting like are you trying to get unstuck or you think you you know you're thinking of trying to find a way out or how to move forward or how someone did something okay because i'm getting yeah like Somebody here is being very positive and something here is working for them. Um, and I'm just getting like you're watching them. Okay. Like I just kind of get like you're kind of watching them. You know, you're kind of guarded. You're trying to protect yourself. You're watching from the outside. Why is the fool card here? eight of wands yes see things started picking up okay we got the empress okay someone here is carrying empress energy okay this could be you this could be someone you're around this could be the person that i feel like you guys are watching like you i, I feel like y'all are watching some someone from the outside looking in you're waiting for this some type of decision to be made i do see things are on hold right now you're kind of isolating yourself okay but I'm getting like, I don't know, y'all. Okay, we got the world card here as well, too. I'm here and didn't think that it would go this far. Two of Pentacles. Somebody here needs to make up their mind. You probably be like waiting for somebody to make up their mind. Um... Yeah, make up your mind. Cause I, I'm getting like y'all are watching. Y'all are watching somebody. And you're going to wait until this person comes back around or when, you know, like when y'all are vibing to kind of, you know, talk to them and ask them, you know. ask them what they think or how they feel like maybe they can, i'm just getting like y'all are watching somebody but i really do feel like you i don't know like y'all are viewing this person as like you know competition or you feel like oh this person ain't no better this person ain't better than me they ain't better than me but I feel like there's someone that you could have been close to or you had some type of connection to this person before, but something may have happened to where you guys aren't that close anymore. Something to that nature. And I just get like you're watching, you know, from the sidelines, kind of like watching, keeping an eye on what's going on. All right, so... um. Let me get a little bit more info. Cause Virgos usually don't get this don't usually get this type of energy. So let's see. Um 
How does this person, how does the person view Virgo? How does this person view Virgo? Um, they could be concerned about you. They're really concerned about you. Like, um, I feel like they're concerned about your well-being. I'm not sure if you guys may have been dealing like with the court system, or they, someone feels that if they're judged by a community of people, a group of people. Yeah, it could be family. Okay. Somebody here, they, they feel like you're a little false, though. They feel like you don't show your true self or you're faking about what's going on in your life, okay? But they are concerned. Um, yeah, courthouse. I'm getting that, you know, some of you could be dealing with the court system. See, we got imprisonment here at the bottom of the deck. Those could be thoughts too. And then we got gift. Okay, unexpected income. So I'm getting like they're wishing the best for you financial wise. Like they're wishing you the best. Okay. They hope that you get it. You give you the universe gifts you with unexpected blessings. Um, I feel like they don't have ill intent towards you at all. Like they're really concerned about your well being. Okay. They're wishing you blessings. Okay. They're they're uh only thing that I see here is this false person. I feel like they do feel like you hide things or you're not as honest. Yeah, see, we got coughing, which is death. Okay, so this is like stop pretending. Okay, stop pretending. Why is coughing here? Main woman. Stop pretending that you're uh, someone's main woman or something like that. Someone here is possibly like in prison. I'm getting imprisonment and expectation. Okay, someone is expecting for someone to be their main lady while they're locked up. I'm, I'm seeing and hearing that as well, too. Um, yeah, wealthy man and imprisonment and bad health. Like, somebody may not be doing too well. Um, and someone expects for you to do the most. Um, they're getting, like, a false feeling about that situation. But what I'm seeing, like, I feel like this person wishes you the best. Like, they don't have any ill intent. They're hoping, you know, like, you get things together. Get an unexpected, uh, you know, a, a, a blessing of income and things of that nature. But I want to know what, what's going on with you guys. Like, do you feel like someone thinks that they're better? Or is there a third party involved that... You know, what's going on? What is this? Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. Because I'm definitely, this is interesting. I want to know. Y'all know I'm nosy. <laughs> All right. So, um, I do want you guys to check out my website, guys. I do have the Hamsa Evil Eye bracelet here. Okay. This is available on the shop. This is the hot selling item guys this this item here since i put this on the shop a few days ago guys they've been selling a lot like i i'm almost sold out um so i still have a few available if you're interested in protection from you know the evil eye jealousy hate uh you know it's just protection okay this is protection bracelet 
I have that on the website as well as a few different other evil eye items, beautiful items, guys. Head over to the website to check those out. That information is in the drop box below. And guys, the oils, the money magnet oils, the goddess oil, um, the big bag oil, all of that is still available on the site. I've, I posted everything back up. We're back in stock. Okay, so check the website out. And if you want to book your very own personal reading, guys, I'm doing 10 minutes for $20, guys. All right. So if you want to book a personal reading, guys, you can get uh, 10 minutes for $20. Okay. So that information is going to be in the drop box below as well as on how to contact me to book a personal reading. Okay. So until next time, my loves, I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao.